Let's start with news that is just breaking today in the college bribery scandal. Lori Lachlan is apparently going to fight it out. Sorry about the bad news, Lori. Are you and your husband fighting this to the end? The fight is on. Both Lori and her husband have pled not guilty to the charges connected to the widespread college admissions cheating scandal. Lori's signature appears on the court filings obtained by ET. The couple have waived their rights to appear in federal court for the arraignment. Legal analyst Rachel Stockman tells ET why Lori's case would be so tough to defend if it goes to trial. According to the prosecution, they have some pretty damning evidence in the form of tapes, recordings of Lori. So I think it's going to be a very hard case to fight in court. If convicted, Lori faces a maximum prison sentence of 40 years. A source close to the actress tells ET when she heard that number, quote, she broke down crying. But her husband feels they are not guilty. They were under the impression they might be breaking rules, but not laws. I paid 500 grand to a women's crew coach to say my daughter was good at rowing. <laughs> I'm a loco. <laughs> On SNL, Kate McKinnon spoofed what Lori's life behind bars could look like. You think prison is hard? I have done 68 Hallmark movies. <laughs> Hell, man. I'm gonna take your heart and I'm gonna cut it out. <laughs> Funny Kate would say that because Lori's Hallmark show, When Calls the Heart, was just renewed for another season, but without Lori. Yeah.